back to Tammy Todd's stuff. So I thought today we'd go over Adam Waldman's latest tweets. I know for most of you, you have Twitter, but there are some people that watch some of my videos that they're not on Twitter. And I'll just say, if I didn't, if I didn't have to have Twitter to be able to keep up with things like Adam Waldman's tweets, to be able to get videos out to you, I don't think I'd have Twitter either. It, it can be, it can be a lot of negative and a lot of horrible, but at the same time, you you see some really good, wonderful people who are doing amazing things. So it's worth all that negative to be able to see the good things. And one of the good things we have is that Adam Wallman, since AH successfully had him removed from being able to be in the courtroom as far as as an attorney for Johnny and Virginia, well, she didn't succeed in getting a gag order. And so he can tweet, he can tweet the truth. And that's what he's doing yet again. He went, he went silent for a while. Um, I think while they were preparing the appeal, he decided to be silent for a while. But now that the appeal is over with, well, he doesn't have to be silent anymore. So we get all these lovely little jewels that he's been putting out over the past several days. And so we've got the newest ones. There's two separate tweets. And let's just get into it. And as always, if you like this video, please leave a thumbs up. Please share this video. You know, feed the algorithm, as Tug says. And just thank you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching my videos. And thank you for everything you do. And of course, there will be a link in the description for my PayPal if you want to help and pay him for the expenses to go to the Virginia trial. But most importantly, this is something that I'm going to be letting everybody know starting this month. Um, at the end of this month, we're going to be doing a charity live stream. Um, I was so touched by the tweets that Jennifer Howell put out over this past weekend that I feel like that as a community, we need to come together and raise some money and show Ms. Howell that we support her and we support her life's work. So there will be a link in the description to the Art of Elysium, which is the charity that Jennifer Howell runs. So, and I'll basically stay tuned. We'll be getting you some more information over next week over what's coming up at the end of this month. But let's get into these tweets from Adam. The first one says, 2014. A.H. letter to U.S. Department of Homeland Security complaining about fraudulent report. Foreigner Savannah McMillan was illegally working as Ms. H.'s assistant. Email. I'm Savannah. A.H.'s assistant. Does that not just sound so... Oh. She literally <laughs> sends an email to the U.S. Department of Homeland Security <laughs> that says, Hi, I'm Savannah, AH's assistant. But you know, hey, I'm not working here illegally. Wow, wow. And, um, <laughs> and then he shows the letter and he circles here. It starts out to him, it may concern. My name is A.H. I'm a proud <laughs> American citizen. But she says, I am writing this letter in response to a fraudulent report about her friend Savannah McMillan. And wow, 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 wow. Uh, and it just, he goes on, he says, Ms. Hurd's UK testimony. Savannah wrote this letter, not me. So, Savannah McMillan, S-A-V-A-N-N-A-H-M-C-M-I-L-L-A-N, misspelled her own name twice. Justice Nichols, featuring Biz Marquis. You say she's just a friend. So I took blah blah's word for this, for it at this time. I thought just having a friend couldn't be no crime. And this is another tweet from Adam. And that, and I, I misspoke. I pulled the wrong picture when I was just reading this. In this letter, she that A.H. writes to 
Homeland Security. She spells Savannah McMillan. Let's see. She spells McMillan. M-C-M-I-L-L-E-N. And yet again, in another paragraph, same spelling again. So Savannah McMillan wrote that letter, and that's what A.H. testifies to, but um, she, she can't she didn't can't spell her own last name. So, uh, uh, wow, wow. But she testified in court that Savannah Savannah wrote that letter. Not, not, not her. But she just didn't know how to spell her own last her own name. Wow. And then Adam provides copies of the transcript of the testimony where A. H. says, "Yes, I didn't write that letter. Savannah did." And then Adam's last tweet. Donate seven million. Jay Nichols donated. Heard donated. Words to memorize. Words hypnotize. Make words make my mouth exercise. Wait a minute, honey. Gonna add it up. Violent films. And then Adam just shows here um, the People magazine where it says A. H. Donates full seven million divorce settlement from Johnny Depp to charity. Then another People magazine. Johnny Depp calls out calls AH's pledge to donate seven million settlement a lie as he seeks to overturn ruling. AH's pledge to donate, but see before they they clearly put she's donated. So, you know, he, he's calling out people here where they're saying that she uh, and he's got a snippet from the article and it says settlement was donated. To charity and then he has another snippet from the article uh, let's see all right uh, let's see but her donation of the seven million to charity is hard that's from judge Dim, <laughs> judge, Dim, judge Nichols uh, verdict where he says her donation of the seven million to charity it the is hardly the act one would expect of a gold digger and then I just want to highlight right quick our own community's sweet chastity. She tweeted to People Magazine and she replied to Adam Wallman and she also tagged People Magazine. Yeah, People Mag, you're so quick to report on AH's generosity. How about a correction of your mistake? If you won't call her out a liar when you obviously screwed up, bad look for you. You rank with the National Enquirer. And I just wanted to give Sweet Chastity a shout out for that because she's right. People Magazine was was really, they've been on it. In fact, Java Noob, I uh, apologize if I mispronounced that name, but she responded right under Sweet Chastity and said, they've been deep in this from the very, from the very start. Remember these? And they added in the pictures that was on the cover of People Magazine when all of this story first broke. So, yes, People Magazine's been with her from the start. And so, you know, Adam's calling them out. And I am so proud of our community for calling out People Mag on this because they should be. They, they, they've they went from saying she donated that money to saying she pledged it. No, she didn't. She pledged to the world that she had donated it already. But she didn't pledge to donate that money. She claimed she donated that money, but yet she never gave an actual dime. Even the money that's been given anonymously is on her behalf. She's never gave an actual dime. And People Magazine should be called out on that. But those are the latest tweets from Adam. I'd like to know what you think about it. Did, did you, if you've got Twitter, did you enjoy seeing the tweets? Do you really love it when he does all this? I know I get up every morning and check it first thing when he's on a Twitter tear. But, you know, just tell me what you think about it. And what do you think about calling out People Magazine? I think we should. So, I think we should call out all these publications that are now changing their tune. Some of them aren't, but some of them are. So, what do you think? As always, leave a comment down below. Thank you for everything you do. And until next time, be blessed. Mm -hmm.